Hello Indonesia, I am Diki Alexander Daton, a third year student of Pharmacy Department of Politikas Kemenkes Makassar. And as a representative of Pemilihan Mahasiswa Berprestasi Politikas Kemenkes Nasional 2023. I was born on Makassar, November 27, 2002. Politikas Kemenkes Makassar has eight departments such as nursing, dentistry, midwifery, medical laboratory technology, nutrition, physiotherapy, environmental health, and pharmacy. When I was studying at pharmacy department of Politikas Kemenkes Makassar, I have various hobbies and doing many activities such as active in conducting research, formulation, community services, and being an enumerator. And I have gained various awards such as In 2021, as a presentation and poster finalist of Community Services of Pekan Ilumia Mahasiswa Nasional Poltekes Kemenkes. In 2022, as a third runner-up of National Pharmaceutical Product Innovation of Polytechnic Medica Usada Mataram. And in the same event, as a second winner of National Pharmaceutical Olympiad Competition, Community Services Volunteer of Badan Eksekutif Mahasiswa that held in Jeneponto, second winner of National Pharmaceutical Innovation Competition of Diponegoro University in Semarang, first winner of Pharmacy Pintar Competition held by Pharmacy Student Association of Politikas Kemenkes Makassar, and in the same event as a second winner of Pharmaceutical Olympiad. Enumerator of survey over-the-counter and limited over-the-counter drug management held by Direktorat Pengelolaan dan Pelayanan Kefarmasian, Kementerian Kesehatan. In 2023, as a second winner of Clinical Pharmaceutical Skill event of Erlangga University in Surabaya. My family told me many things to gain something that we want, find many relations in public, and prioritize what we need instead of what we want. I believe that our skill and our future come from how we organize activities, solve the problem, and how to communicate as well to others. I am here to present an insight about the anemia. Anemia is a condition in which red blood cells do not meet the physiological needs of the body, which is under 12 mg per deciliter. As we could see, until this second, the anemia cases were still increasing, especially in developing countries such as Indonesia. Most of anemia causes contagious in adolescent girls, but why? Adolescent girls have a higher risk of anemia due to an increase of requirement, low intake of hematopoid nutrients, and the routine of menstrual cycle that release many red blood cells. As we could see the graphic of anemia prevalences of adolescent girl in Indonesia from the risk studies on 2007, 2013, and 2018 is still increasing. The government has distributed iron tablets in school for adolescent girls to against anemia. But in fact, the adolescent girl interest of iron tablet consumption is still lacking. The data from risk dust on 2018 show that the percentage of acquisition iron tablet in adolescent girl are reversed with the consumption percentage. Therefore, we need an innovation to overcome this problem so that I motivated to develop a product to overcome this problem called Sesamia. Pengembangan biji wijen hitam sesamum indikum dalam formulasi granul effervescence sebagai suplemen anti anemia pada remaja putri. So the methods to formulate these products are prepare tools and materials for the formula that I use as in the table formula, which equal proportion of acids and base, active ingredients, filling agent, flavor agent, and binder agent. Grind the black sesame seed and then sift them. Wake all ingredients to be used. Grind until a homogeneous mixture of acids, namely citric acid, tartaric acid, some lactose, sucrose, and natrium CMC. And do the same things for the mixture of bases, namely sodium bicarbonate, lactose, sucrose, and NaCMC. 
the mixture then sift respectfully. Both mixtures are put into the oven at 65 degrees Celsius for 5 minutes. After heating, both two mixtures then grind it until homogeneous. The mixture then put in back to the oven at 40 degrees Celsius for 5 minutes. After the products were made, products then packaged for 10 grams each and then test for the effervescent granule quality requirements include flow rate taste obtains a semi granule flow rate of 10.23 seconds this result is in accordance with the effervescent granule flow rate requirement which is not more than 10 seconds angle of repose obtained the angle of repose of the semi granule is 17.74 degree this result is in accordance with the angle of repose requirement of effervescent granules namely under or equal to 25 degree. Dispersion time test. The sesamia granule dispersion time was obtained for 87 seconds. This result is in accordance with the requirement for effervescent granule dispersion time which is between 1 to 2 minutes. pH test. Sesamia pH was found to be in the range of 6.72 to 7.54 and in accordance with the physical quality requirements. Moisture content test. It was found that the water content of sesamia was 0.69%. This result is in accordance with the requirement for effervescent granule moisture content, namely 0.4% till 0.7%. The implementations of this sesamia product called Desite. Desite is a shortened word of Decrease the incidence of anemia in adolescent girl, convenient in use, introducing natural ingredients, black sesame seeds which are able to overcome anemia, and developing natural ingredients into effervescent granule pharmaceutical formulations. Sesamia has some excess, such as sesamia made from natural ingredients which is black sesame seeds. The previous research concluded that the black sesame seeds had the activity of increasing hemoglobin level at anemia condition. Sesamia has acceptable taste and look for adolescents and for communities. So this product is expected to decrease the number of anemia cases in Indonesia. Because the innovative and integrity younger will bring the bright future for Indonesia from Politeka's Kemenkes Makassar to Indonesia. Yeah.